On February 18, Union Minister of Commerce and Industry, Piyush Goyal, met with a delegation from the United Arab Emirates in a bilateral meeting and signed the Comprehensive Economic Partnership Agreement, SEPA. The two countries' partnership has resulted in joint work on a number of agreements and memorandums of understanding in a variety of areas, including the economy, climate change, and Hubara conservation, industries and advanced technologies, low carbon, hydrogen development and investment, food security, financial services, and education cooperation. Both India and the United Arab Emirates have agreed to establish an Indian Institute of Technology IIT, in the UAE as part of their trade agreement. This will be the first time an IIT has been established outside of the country. In India, there are now 23 IITs that provide B.Tech and doctoral programs. IIT Delhi, Bombay, Karagpur, Madras and others are among the country's leading IITs. The two countries will also establish an India-UAE Cultural Council to assist and promote cultural initiatives, cross-cultural exchanges and exhibits, among other things, according to the agreement. India and the United Arab Emirates have also committed to assist each other's clean energy initiatives and to form a cooperative hydrogen task force to scale up technologies, mainly green hydrogen production. It will also work together on essential technologies, promote e-businesses and e-payment solutions, and help startups from both nations. The free trade agreement that India and the United Arab Emirates inked on Friday will lower tariffs on 80% of commodities and provide duty-free access to 90% of India's exports to the UAE. The pact, which is anticipated to take effect in about 60 days, is estimated to increase annual bilateral commerce to $100 billion in five years, up from roughly $60 billion now. After 88 days of discussions, Commerce and Industry Minister Piyush Goyal and UAE Minister of Economy Abdullah bin Tuk Al Mari signed the Comprehensive Economic Partnership Agreement. India has also begun official FTA discussions with the United Kingdom with the goal of reaching an early harvest trade deal in the coming months.